Good morning and welcome to Savannah Nun Music. Today we're going to begin a new series on the channel, a book review series. Today we're going to focus on the author Mark Hayes who does a lot of arrangements of hymns. So if you're a person who likes to find new interesting ways of doing these hymns, these books are for you. Um, lots of different levels but I'm going to go through a detailed review and also play a few samples. So if you're interested, keep watching. Let's get started. So the first book we're going to be talking today is the Mark Hayes for the Intermediate Pianist Hymn Settings That Touch the Soul, arranged by Mark Hayes. So I guess by Hymns That Touch the Soul, this is more of a soothing. All the arrangements in this book are soothing and slow, kind of, and just peaceful. So let's talk about what songs are in here. I'm just going to name a few because there's this big long list and I'm not going to read the whole thing. Um, this is My Father's World, Holy, 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 Amazing Grace, Praise Him, Praise Him, There is a Fountain, um, Brethren We Have Met to Worship. So there's a lot of different popular hymns in him, but there's also some that I don't know. Um, More Love to the O Christ, Spirit of God Descend Upon My Heart, My Shepherd Will Supply My Need. I've actually played a few of those and they're beautiful even though I don't even know them. Um, so the styles of this is more like prelude, not classical, but just soft and quiet and peaceful. So the difficulty of this, it says it's for intermediate and I would say that's about right. Some of the arrangements are harder than others. They're all pretty long. There's not very many that are just, well, there's none that are just two pages, uh, front and back is what I mean by two pages. Um, they're all about four or five. Um, for me, for somebody who's more advanced, if you can, you can just sit down and sight read this pretty much. I mean, there's some that'll be more tricky, but for the most part, you'll be able to sight read it. For people who are intermediate, this would be really good. Um, you'd have to work on it a little bit, maybe for a week, maybe for two weeks, uh, depending on how much you practice. But this is a really, really, really good book, and I highly recommend this to any of you. So, I'm going to play a sample for you. I'm going to start with Amazing Grace. And I'll play two samples of each, of each book that I talk about today. But just so you get a sense of what this will sound like, this is Amazing Grace. Don't judge me perfectly. I'm just sight reading. Um, I actually have never worked on that one, but I think it's really beautiful. Um, so there's Amazing Grace, just to give you a little sample of what it sounds like. This is Christians we have met to worship in the book. I call it Brethren we have met to worship, however you like to say it. Um, also about this, they're in several different keys. Um, Amazing Grace was in G and this is an A flat. So you have a little a range of keys here. So here's Christians we have met to worship.
get the point there. I love that one. That one sounds so pretty to me. I don't know. I think it's all the fourths that are in there. But anyway, so there's this book. Highly, highly recommend. So the next book we're going to look at is the Mark Hay. This is also intermediate. It says level two at the top. This doesn't have a level. Um, but this one says level two. It's the Mark Hayes Jazz Hymns for the Intermediate Pianist, arranged by Mark Hayes. So let's talk about some of the songs in here. Oh, I see here it has some ads here on the back. This is level two. I haven't seen a level one, but apparently that's level two. So is this. This has stuff like This Little Light of Mine, Wayfaring Stranger, I've Got Peace Like a River, Blessed Assurance, Revive Us Again, What a Friend We Have in Jesus, Day by Day, We're Marching to Zion, Children's Song Medley. <coughs> There's several in this book. Um, this one is one of my favorites. I actually did a hymn CD, a piano hymn CD not too long ago, and I used some of the arrangements in here. The style of this book is jazz, obviously. It says jazz on the cover. Um, some of them are kind of a slow jazz and some of them are kind of a fast jazz and you'll see that in a minute because I've picked two contrasting samples to play. The difficulty, I would say this is a little bit more difficult than the last one we looked at, which is weird because they're both level two. I absolutely love this book. This is really good. Um, so let's play a sample. Let's do my favorite. Well, one of my favorites from this book is this little light of mine. So let's see what it sounds like. Excuse my playing if I mess up. So there's a lot of key changes in that song and that's really good. It gives it a lot of variety and for intermediate pianists that may be something that's new to you but you need to get into it because this happens a lot in music. So that's a really fun sample. And the next one that I want to do is a bit slower and it is page 48, Blessed Assurance. So let's get a taste of this one. So that's super pretty. That's just an example of a slower style, but there's a lot of fun ones in here. Wayfaring Stranger is also really good, but I'm going to refrain from playing it too because this video will be forever long. It's already at 10 minutes almost. So let's begin on the next set. This is the Best of Mark Hayes Volume 1 and Volume 2 series. I believe there's only a Volume 1 and Volume 2 in this series so, so far. Um, these I def definitely recommend to more advanced players. These, I think these are advanced. Is that, it doesn't say they're for advanced players, but these should be, I mean, these are harder than the ones we've looked at so far. Very much so. Um, but they're not too difficult to play. I don't want to sound scary, but it is more 
if, it, if an, an intermediate player played these, it would take them a little longer. At least a lot of them. Some of them aren't so bad. But let's start with volume one. So this has a lot of songs in it. More than those. It's pretty thick. I mean, you can see it's pretty thick. So some of the songs in here, um, there are some for different holidays. So there's, I think, maybe one Christmas song, Silent Night. And there's also some patriotic songs in here, so that's good for patriotic holidays. Um, but there's also Savior Like a Ship, Savior Like a Shepherd Lead Us, um, His Eyes on the Sparrow, Amazing Grace. Again, it's a different arrangement. Um, Nobody Knows the Trouble I've Seen, um, It Is Well With My Soul, Higher Ground, Jesus Keep Me Near the Cross, Joshua Fit the Battle of Jericho, Be Thou My Vision, things of that nature. Um, there are all styles in this book. It's not just a single style. There's jazz, there's uh, faster, there's slower, um, peppy, there's really dramatic. Um, and I'm just going to read, there's a little paragraph up here at the top and I'm going to read to you what it says. It says, here is the one you've been waiting for. Here it is. Legendary pianist composer Mark Hayes has compiled the best of his best into an amazing, I don't know what that word is. Anyway, of praise that will become an indispensable addition to your sacred library. All of Mark's amazing versatility is here. From jazzy contemporary songs to classic hymn settings, from virtuosic concert pieces to meditative worship moments that will thrill the soul and melt the heart. Don't miss this best-selling treasury of one of America's most celebrated arrangers. Highly recommended. Highly recommended is what it says. Here. You want this. That's more case. So anyway, so you have some songs that aren't necessarily hymns in here. You have hymns. You have some that are really crazy and you can play them in a concert hall. And then you have some you can just play for meditative worship, whatever. There's lots of variety in this. So let's play a sample. I'm going to play for you Josh will fit the Battle of Jericho. And I still don't understand fit. I thought it was fought, but I mean... Maybe fits past tense? Thought is past tense. I don't know, but anyway, I've never played these especially, so bear with my sight reading skills. So here's what this sounds like. And these samples may be a little shorter. You get the point of what it sounds like really mysterious um it has a lot of a jazz feel as you can see just by looking at it there's a lot of notes on this page um let's also do page 39 nobody knows the trouble i've seen this also has all day and all night in it so there are a few medleys um but anyway here's how this sounds played it. I need to because I like it. So there's volume one. Volume two is a little less thick. So the songs that are in here, it says at the top, the best of Marquet's volume two is a follow-up to the tremendously successful blah 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 blah. When the first compilation contained hymns, this second collection contains contemporary classics. This is such as In Christ Alone, I'd Rather Have Jesus, Great is Thy Faithfulness, and much more. So, that's what you get in this one. This one's pretty hard. Um, 
but most of the music in this is a little quiet, well not quiet, but softer, and there's some really virtuosic pieces in here. So some as great as thy faithfulness, sing to the Lord, the light of the world is Jesus. People need the Lord, the love of Jesus medley, resurrection medley, so several medleys. Um, Alfred Burt Carroll medley, that may have something to do with Christmas, don't know. He giveth more grace, no one ever cared for me like Jesus. So there's a lot in here, um, but I'm going to play a little excerpt of Great Is Thy Faithfulness. Same way with Volume 1. This I recommend for those who are a little more experienced. Otherwise, I mean, I don't want intermediate players to pick this up and think it's going to be easy and then get discouraged and frustrated because they get frustrated. Even I get frustrated trying to play these and then start where the melody will come in. Sort of. This is what it sounds like. And I have to turn page, so bear with me. and so forth so that's a really good one I think that's very pretty this one I've seen a lot of people play it on YouTube actually so if you want to hear a good version of it go check that out um, and I'd like to play a little excerpt of page 19 I'd rather have Jesus um, same thing with this one I'm gonna skip to where the melody begins so here it goes So that's really jazzy and pretty and awesome. Um, but I mean, there's key changes and all that good stuff in here. So I highly recommend Mark Hayes. He's a really great arranger. And trust me, I have lots more of his books. This is only part one. We're going to do another video next time that will have the rest of my collection of Mark Hayes. I don't have all of them. I will one day, hopefully. Um, but yeah, we have... The next time we're going to go over just a few more and then we're going to start on some other arrangers of hymns and see which one that you like the best. I prefer Mark Hayes a lot because he has more to grab onto. He has more to choose from um, than some of the others. I can just find books here and there, but I highly recommend him. He's a very good one. Um, but anyway, so let me know if you liked this. I hope to do a lot more of things like this, not even just with hymns. I can do it with any books in general. Um, I'd love to review for you. These are really great for piano teachers. Keep this in mind if you're wanting your kids, maybe if they're a little more advanced to learn hymns, this is a good one um, to choose from. But anyway, I hope you all have a great day. Stay healthy during the COVID-19 outbreak and I will see you next time. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and see ya.